a lot of rain. It's a lot of rain. No idea. What does one do? <laughs> I'm like underneath this little little lip, so I'm personally dry, but it just means that practices get a little difficult. Anyway, so be it. Here we are. Good morning. Mia's. Mia's looking at me. Mm-hmm. Hey. Because I was trying to get this video, but it seems like a bit of a silly decision. Right, guys, we're changing it up. Not going to get much weirder. All right. In with the safety of the inside. All right. I'm just going to quickly draw this card. Don't have a whole lot of time. What have we got? Oh, not bad. Is that really the time? Huh. 17 minutes. That could be way worse. As we do, morning routine. Power list, breath work. And then a little meditation. <laughs> Woke up and my eyes were just unbelievably heavy I was like not keen to get up you know when your eyes are just like what the fuck where am I who am I what's going on that was me today and then the snooze alarms go off and you're like mission Divine healing. Honor your sensitivity. Retreat to recharge and heal. Your light can support others. Most of that is just fucking lame to me, but your light can support others. I like that. I truly believe that that's like it. If you can get yourself into a <coughs> into a position where you're just genuinely happy and stoked, then that's going to you know, like, bleed off onto the people around you. Because we're always, we're always impacting everyone that we meet, whether we like it or not, good or bad. And like this card saying, your light can support others. If you genuinely are in a good place, then other people will feel that and hopefully receive that and feel less judged by people in the world to do what they want to do, which is really cool. Oh yeah, the um, the little interview thing last night, that was pretty cool. Met this woman, Tuma, T-U-M-A. I don't know how do you say that. I don't know how do you say that. <laughs> Mia, how do you reckon you say T-U-M-A as a name? T-U-M-A? Yeah, because like Tuma. Tuma, yeah. Tuma. Yeah. Like Tuma, but it's a T. Yeah. Mm. Tuma. It was a T. And anyway, so she's, she just like wanted to ask me some questions and stuff. And then um, from there, book another interview where I'm recording from my phone. She's interviewing me from my laptop and I can send like the quality footage over to her after the interview that they'll chop up and use in like social media content and stuff, which is I think pretty fucking cool and might actually lead to me being able to get my verified TikTok account because that will be another media outlet talking about me which is what you need to get verified on TikTok so that's cool anyway so that's coming up later in the week it's so buzzy <laughs> how crazy is it that TikTok is opening little things like that it's cool as fuck man Something I always feel like I'm not doing is making enough content. I know I'm making these daily videos, but relevant content that's helping to build Kairos and my personal brand. I really, 
yeah, I just believe in social media, I believe in content, and I believe that it's super good for building awareness and things like that, and, and also you can create financial freedom and all this other stuff. I'm yet to experience that, but hopefully this is more where this is leading. But yeah, I really want to be creating more. Anyway, guys, breath work, meditation time. I appreciate you guys tuning in. Tap in, get clear, do your shit, get it done, all the rest of it. Have a beautiful day. We'll check in later. Swag. Should probably say, it might, it might be very. You guys might think if you're watching this, you might think, "Whoa, he's so stoked and inspired and going hard every day," and that's not the truth. I can't be fucked a lot of the time. Yeah, but we 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 try to do things anyway. <laughs> Motivation. Okay. Bye. Bye. Cheeky lunch break adventure with the bro. This. Apple low bros. Yeah. We on. Some digger driving coming up. Let's go. There was a sword at this property. Now for the big test. Can he dump it in the barrow? Can he accomplish his game? Oh, that's a pretty good dump. That's not a bad little dump right there. That's not a bad little dump right there. And then there's the pace of an actual digger truck. <laughs> Who's actually picking up massive scoops. Instant dumpage. It's an art. So good. Cool. Oh, bro. Fucking. <laughs> well, I'm way too excited about it. Well, that was a day. That was a cool day at work, it was cool to play on the digger, it was genuinely good, but I just have an undertone of can't be fucked today. And considering I've been feeling absolutely on form motivation wise for a long time, um, it's not, you know, I don't feel like it's a big deal or anything. And to be fair, it's not even going to fucking affect anything, and the more that I speak, the more I realise I'm just being a bitch, and I'm not tired. I'm all good, I'm ready to go, and I'm not just saying that for affirmation's sake, I'm saying that because, like, that's just the way it goes, like, it's not like, I don't know, I feel like so many of us get unmotivated or get, like, a rough day or a hard day or just, like, average mood or whatever, and then we just stop, but, like, this is part of the plan, part of the plan is to have days where you can't be fucked, that's part of the plan, part of the equation to go where we're trying to go to get where we're trying to get so yeah anyway on an exciting note and now i'm speaking i'm getting pumped mace is in the back going to drop some more orders off at the post office sent a bunch out yesterday sending some more now got three to send now and then i'm going to pick up a pre-workout from the supermarket come back home and train hard as fuck yesterday was yoga so irrelevant of how i feel today i'm going to bust out an intense session because Yesterday, I listened to my body and took it easy. And so today, irrelevant of what my body says, I'm gonna jam and go hard. So, yeah, let's do this. Even if we can't be fucked, let's do the things, let's go. Our dreams are waiting for us. <laughs> Motivation and all that shit. But actually, jokes aside, let's fucking go. Yo, yo, what's Gucci guys? How we doing? Um, just from the post office, just had a little pre-workout, and I'm gonna get into this. Suddenly, my mood has shifted. I'm feeling extremely inspired and motivated, and I'm keen as fuck to train. And it's just the way this goes. You 
you forget what you're up to, you do your practices, you, you do the state changes I was talking about, and then you're back into the zone, feeling in the zone, ready to train, um, got some Nipsey hustle in my ears, feeling fucking pumped. And yeah, just got back from the post office, like I said, posted a few more maces out. Almost all of the orders have gone out, just some bigger orders to send now. Unbelievable how like this, these are the steps required to get to the dream and it's happening. And a lot of this inspiration I'm feeling right now has come from having voice messages with Gabriel and we're just going back and forth, like just feeling inspired, talking about what we're up to and everything like that. And it's just super cool. So anyway, let's hope this wind doesn't blow the phone off. Kind of sketched about that. But let's get into it. Just gonna do some boxing training and then some mace stuff. And then maybe some rings. I'm gonna see how I feel. I just feel like moving, so we're gonna move. Let's go. fact I found this thing in a bush one time at my old job I used to work in conservation doing pest animal plant control stuff like that one day I was walking in the bush someone had just ditched this picked it up set it up gave it away and sure enough it worked so I brought it home and I I use it like a couple times a week religiously it's so good just like reflexes getting used to the timing so much fun, honestly. Strength stage of the session. That was 20 25 minutes of play. Warm up. Now I'm going to get into some monkey press. You guys will see what that is. Monkey press and maybe some pull ups, and we'll leave it at that. So let's get into it. Last set, so you know that means we have to get six of each. Let's roll. Workout done. Thank you guys for watching. That was fun as fuck. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I just came around to Mia's and she's whipped up the most fucking amazing pasta and I'm about to eat it and I'm so hungry. It's gonna be so good. <laughs> What's up, dudes? All right, I'm just editing today's video and 
my workout segment, the audio didn't pick up properly from the mic because obviously I didn't connect them properly. So yeah, apologies for that if you've got this far in the video. Um, but it's one of those things. I'm learning how to work the mics, how to work the mics. And uh, I feel like something like that won't happen again because I'll actually make sure it's connected properly and won't just assume. But you know how it is, learning curves, all that. I'm fucking tired. Uh, and yeah, we're going to get it again tomorrow. I'm loving creating these videos. It helps me very much keep accountable. And yeah, I just also want to document this whole process because I truly believe what I'm up to and what me and Gabriel are up to and everything that I've been working towards for a fucking long time is actually going to happen and this is going to be very fun to look back on. So that's pretty much what this is all about. To show the process, whether it's in 1, 2, 3, 4, 7, 8, 15 years, however long it takes. But yeah, it's going to be fun to look back on. Anyway, much love guys. I really genuinely do appreciate you tuning in if you are watching. And we'll see you in tomorrow's video. Sweet.